Well, happy 2020, everybody. It was a nice way to start off the year with January temperatures uh, here, at least on the first in the 40s and even 50s. So well above average. We do have some cloud cover coming our way as we go through the evening hours. You might notice, well, not only here on the radar, some green, but even on your uh, weather app on your phone, some radar returns uh, later this evening into tonight. That rain will never make it all the way to the ground. The air just too dry, but nonetheless, at the ground, we've got those south southwest winds, which will continue to pop in the mild air, so that's why we only expect to get lows in the mid 30s tonight. Not a far fall from where we are as we go through the evening and then with increasing clouds for our Thursday, still mild with the favorable winds beneath those clouds. We might not see a whole lot of sun, but we'll still get those temperatures into the 40s and even some 50s off to the south of Highway 34. But later tomorrow night into Friday, that's when we get some rain, which on Friday mixes with cold enough uh, air to turn some of that over to snow. But check out the numbers for Thursday. Wow, low to mid 30 uh, 40s, I should say even upper 40s north of Interstate 80 as we drop south by 80. Look at what happens south of Highway 34. Low 50s possible along Highway 34. Mount Pleasant to Burlington to Galesburg could see temperatures right around 50 degrees and here in the metro will top off around 47 or 48. A little bit of sunshine, but a mostly cloudy sky with southwest winds at 5 to 10. Mostly cloudy, but still mild. Those southwest winds giving us that nice air. Check out the seven day. We do cool it off on Friday as we turn any rain over to a little bit of snow. 38 the high, 35 on Saturday with some lingering flurries in the morning, and then we'll dry things out for the second half of the weekend. Sunday we go to 40, and we'll keep those highs in the mid and upper 30s into the first half of next week.